Hello everyone, this is Sam from the Twinsburg Public Library and welcome to this video tutorial we have. Um, so today we're going to be going over how to troubleshoot some basic Wi-Fi issues you might be having on your Chromebook. Um, just a quick note, um, we are going to be focusing Chromebooks, um, but if you found your way here for with, you know, for a Mac or PC, don't worry, it's going to be very similar. The steps are going to be very similar on those. They're just going to look a little bit different because there's a different interface for each of those. So um, let's just get started here. So the first thing that you're going to probably run across when it comes to uh, connection issues is you want to make sure that your, um, your Wi-Fi is turned on. So what we want to do is you're going to look at the very bottom right of the screen, you're going to see this little oval. Uh, this is what's known as a notification bar. And what you want to do is, um, you, if you see it, this uh, looks like a pie slice, um, you can see mine right here, it's it's white. Um, that means it's actually connected um, to a source, but if it's grayed out, it's not connected to a network. So what we could do, or what we're going to do, is we're going to click on the notification bar and you'll see a box pop up and we're looking for the same icon that is down in the notification bar in this panel this box um, this shows our uh, Wi-Fi network that we're connected to now if it's turned off it will just be gray like that it'll be gray with an empty pie slice that just means your uh, connectivity is turned off to turn it back on you can just click on the but the icon and it will take you to this screen right here and you can notice that there's this little switch like uh this little switch like thing it looks like a switch and that's basically what it is it's a switch that you can click to turn it on and off so that'll be the first thing you want to check the second thing you want to check is make sure that you're actually connected to an, uh, a wi-fi network to a network um so a lot of times, especially if you're moving into, uh, if you're in a place where you haven't connected to a network before, um, your Wi-Fi will be on, but your computer just doesn't know what to do because it doesn't, you have to tell it to connect. So when you come in, so when you go to this panel and you click on the button to turn, to turn your Wi-Fi on, you should see a list of available networks. So you can see right here, um, we do have an available network, the Twinsburg Public Library Wi-Fi, and that's uh, that is the open Wi-Fi network here. So uh, it connected, we connected to it. Uh, it connected to it, and since this computer um, was connected to it previously, it remembered that network, so um, it connected to it automatically. Uh, now, sometimes, since um, you will be running into issues where the network that you're trying to connect to won't go automatically and even if you click on it it's not gonna it, it will give you some issues because you need to put a password in so let's say this network right here the v35 thank you that's just my phone set up as a net as a wireless hotspot so if we were to try to connect to it we would get this box saying that um we needed a password now um sometimes when you are connected to a network that you used previously, uh, the password could be wrong, placed uh, and put it wrong, or it may have changed. So it's always good to double check. Put this in here real quick. It's always good to double check to make sure that the password on your connection is correct. Um, okay, so if you wanted to check the network password it's kind of hard to do that the easiest way to fix this issue would probably just be forget the to forget the network um so uh if you go over to the notification tab and into your wi-fi network available networks you click on the name of the network you're connected to best way to uh, at least the best way the quickest way to fix this issue if it were a just a bad password just forget the network and then 
go in and then reconnect to it and just make sure that you put in the right password. And what's really nice is see this little eye right here. If you click on it, it will show you the password. So if you have that way, you can make sure that the password is correct before entering it in. Okay. So th that's just, oop, that was an error there, but it should have worked. I think my phone just turned off. Anyways, so that just a quick little tutorial, quick little um, video. If you happen to have any other questions about connectivity issues, something, because these were just basic, um, basic tips to check um, that anyone can do. If you need any, if you get anything else that's maybe a little bit more in depth, um, you can always try calling um, some sort of IT service or, you know, we could try helping you here at the library if you bring your Chromebook in or, or even giving us a call. Um, so other than that, I hope you this was helpful and I hope you all have a great day. Bye.